Mzansi, a case of fraud has been opened against uh, this Zola 7. Hey, hey, Mzansi. Hello and welcome to Entertainment News, Mzansi. If you're new to my channel, you know you have for the stories, go ahead, click the subscribe button and uh, the bell and you'll never miss an update. So, Mzansi, a case of fraud has been opened against a man posing as Bonginkosi Zola 7 Lamini. Now, this comes after Queen K deposited 10,000 rand for Zola to perform, only to be told the money went to the wrong account. Now, things have been tense between Zola 7 and Queen K. Mzansi since she recently posted an event poster on Facebook with his face in it. When Zola saw it, he told his fans that he had not been paid and would not be performing. I know nothing about this event. I wasn't paid, but I see there's already a poster in circulation. So if you attend this event to see me, well, do not waste your time, he wrote. However, Mzansi, Queen K insisted that she had booked and paid Zola. Now, she has since told a local public Publication that she opened a case against the Zola 7 imposter. I decided to open a case because I was scammed. I maintain I believe that I spoke to Zola 7, not someone else. Now my suspicions are even stronger because his wife and manager, Sigi Kunene, have been harassing me, she alleged. She is demanding that I change the story. She feels I painted Zola as a bad person and their business is being affected by this. But I told her I wouldn't do this because I was scammed in his name. I told I also had a reputation to protect. I even advised her to put their side of the story in the public domain so we can do a joint statement, but she refused to claim Queen K. Now, Mzansi, the Sun team made numerous attempts to get hold of Siki, but she uh, failed to respond to calls and messages. Northwest Police spokesperson Brigadier Sabata Mokwabone confirmed that a case was opened but said no arrests have yet been made. In 2020, Mzansi, Zola 7 was involved in similar drama when he asked fans to donate towards music instruments for Sipo Setu Manisa. The boy's father, Sibusiso, later told the Sun team that they never received the money. Well, there you have it, Mzansi. Drama, drama keeps falling on the Mzansi streets. Now, do you guys believe that Queen K has been scammed by Zola 7, Zola 7, or an imposter, Zola 7? Do let me know your thoughts in the comment section. You know I love to hear from you. But for now, you know, I will bring you the updates hard just the way you like it.